Today I'm going to show you how to make a basic tail Simple animation So what I gotta do is, the first thing you want to do is convert from the cards And Now all I gotta do is Add a plus Then you have a cube You have a cube Make sure it's centered And then it's directly in the middle and I can move it out a bit. Did I mess up the scale? There we go. Let's make this a uh, medium size scale. It's 3.5 to 3.5. And then we center it. You can also make a big tail, but. I'll show, I'll show a picture of that right now because it's pretty complicated and so I've only seen one version of it. And then you shrink it a bit. So normally I do it like a three part tail because it's the simplest to animate. Because in my opinion, tails don't look good without the animation. So let's make that a different color. So now we gotta center this. What button do you press? Okay, we need a different color for this too. Another easy thing you can do is move place and then put this thing inside that one. Then you have an easy moving tail, but then you have to reset that with this one. Let's put this one up here too. 2.5. And then we move the middle one in a bit. There we go, now I have a simple tail. It's not perfect, but we can fix that real quick. This tail is a bit too big for my in my opinion, but it's probably fine. So then you want to go to animations and let's just make a basic standing animation for it. I like to move additive because it makes it just a bit more convenient when animating. But you don't have to do that. Additive can be useful at some points. So let's make it this really simple. to the exact opposite. And then it's decrease the uh, duration to 2500. That's how long the animation will take. And then boom, you got a basic tail animation. It's that easy, and if you want, you can retexture it pretty easily. So I gotta do is, like, switch it. You can also, well, you have to increase the size of your texture sheet, but that, that that's, that's for another time. But just remember, if you wanna if you wanna texture your tail and not just have it be a solid base color, you're gonna have to increase the size of your skin. And all I gotta do is file export and boom. That's about it. Thanks.